Social media users are calling out Ellen again, but this time it's over a resurfaced video where Ellen shamed an audience member for stealing. It's not that simple though. Ellen set up a social experiment where she put out a bunch of free merch on a table to see if her audience members would take more than one item after they were told not to take more than one item. She then shamed the audience member for taking more than one item on national television. At the time, the joke seemed like, ah, oh, it's good fun, it's Ellen, she's just joking around. But now that Ellen's on screen for Sona is being called into question, people are calling this social experiment just plain mean. What's gravy fam jam? This is Inform Overload. I'm Charlotte. On this channel, we do the news, we make it entertaining. So if you're sick of the same old news cycle, hit that subscribe and notification bell and follow the IO gang on our socials. Being an audience member on Ellen used to be a coveted experience. Ellen had the reputation for being an extremely positive person who always preached be kind. It was also not uncommon for audience members to get freebies or win prizes on camera if they were on the show. But now that the Ellen DeGeneres show is facing accusations of a toxic workplace, rampant sexual harassment, and Ellen herself is being exposed for being not so nice to the little people, people are going through all her past encounters and looking at them with a new perspective. There was this one particular incident which is now being looked at with new eyes where an audience member named Nancy was publicly shamed by Ellen on national television for taking one too many freebies. The original clip actually ended up being deleted from Ellen's YouTube channel, at least as far as I know. I tried to look it up so that I could at least show you guys, but it's gone. So that gives you an idea for how bad this is. I'll just explain to you what happened. Ellen set up a test to quote, see how honest the audience was. She put out a bunch of free Ellen merch, just like a bunch of plastic stuff, like hats that probably cost like a cent to make. And then she told audience members that they could take one item each for free. The team set up hidden cameras everywhere, as well as a two way mirror right in front of the table with free stuff on it. And when it came time to tape the show, Ellen said she wanted to see if she could catch anyone stealing, in her words. Which is like, I'm sorry, if you put out a bunch of plastic freebies with no attendant, people are gonna take more than one. Like, if they are, that's just. So Wait, just me? <laughs> It turns out that Nancy was the only person in the entire audience who ended up taking more than one freebie. She took two. She took an extra piece of swag for her sister who couldn't be there for the taping. Anyways, the whole thing was caught on camera and then Ellen spent a good few minutes accusing this audience member of stealing. Now based on what I saw from the social experiment, Nancy was a good sport about it. You could tell she was a bit embarrassed. She was on national television. She might have felt like crying and she might have cried after the taping, but she couldn't have done it like on camera. As she's being grilled by Ellen, Nancy explains that she only took an extra gift for her sister who loves Ellen and couldn't come to the taping and Ellen says in response, a lot of people's sisters couldn't come. Ellen continues, you are one of those people who go trick or treating and take the whole bowl. Wait, no one else did that? <laughs> I'm just kidding. So then Ellen sends Nancy to Ellen jail. It's a bit silly to be honest, but a lot of people felt like this little experiment was a bit harsh, frankly, and borderline bullying. Like I said, the video was deleted from Ellen's channel as far as I know, but here were some comments posted to the What's Trending news video about it. Wow, that's gross. So basically she set this entire thing up just so she'd find someone that stole, just so she could publicly humiliate and bully them while she sadistically smiles. This is sadism. She's happy she orchestrated this entire thing. It's gross. Such a garbage person. Next, so the person who always talks about happiness and positivity is now shaming and humiliating a fan for stealing a $10 hat. It was probably not $10 actually. It was probably probably it was it was free like it, it was it doesn't doesn't cost much next imagine this woman coming back to her home her family giggling and her trying to get a job the boss might think she's going to steal her life is kind of messed up now thanks a lot ellen next and lastly i feel really bad for nancy ellen couldn't have just told her in private instead of telling the whole entire audience making nancy feel embarrassed also i don't think it's stealing if the merch was free and nancy was just a big fan of ellen which is why she wanted more than one of the things that were free Anyways guys, I want you to tell me how you feel about this one. Was the joke not really a big deal or was Ellen too harsh on this audience member? Let me know. I'm just gonna quickly wrap this one up with some common features. Tammy said, celebrity drama go brr. <laughs> I don't know what that means. What does that mean? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Animal Crossing Addict said, I love how Charlotte won't hold back if you're mean to her. No, I won't. That's it for me. Thanks for watching. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you want more. I'll see you guys next time. What's gravy fan? This is Inform Overload. I'm Charlotte. I spat everywhere. <laughs> Sorry. Well, can I just try that again? I just fucking. <laughs> Sorry, you wanna wipe should I wipe that?